It's as if Syria's regime has lost or given up control of parts of the country. In Hama, protests have taken on a scale we haven't seen before. And the military is reported to have pulled out of the town completely, leaving behind jubilant crowds. Similar scenes were captured in other cities and even on the outskirts of the capital, according to this footage posted today, but whose authenticity we can't verify. The Syrian army was out in force elsewhere. Rock-throwing protesters clashed with heavy armour in Homs, where at least half a dozen were reported to have been killed by the army. And armour units prowled the streets of Damascus, apparently shooting at protesters despite regime claims that soldiers are being ordered not to fire unless shot at themselves. In Aleppo, club-wielding thugs moved in, apparently on the steps of a mosque. The dreaded Shabiha, loyalist goons, sent in to intimidate and beat up the opposition. The world is continuing to give the Assad regime the benefit of the doubt and more time to move from repression to reform. But for yet another Friday, a regime that says it's serious about dialogue has used its military to shoot, kill and injure its own people. Dominic Waghorn, Sky News.